before we go for bombay blood group system we must need to know about the abo blood group system and how the antigen a or antigen b synthesis takes place on the surface of rbc so here it is the rbc and that is the precursor chain on the surface of rbc this is the edge gene and all these are the a b and ab gene first of all edge gene is must for the synthesis of either antigen a or antigen b edge gene which encodes fucosyl transferase enzyme which transfers l fucose to this precursor chain so this l fucose plus precursor chain collectively known as edge substance the synthesis of edge substance is must either for the synthesis of antigen a or antigen b without edge substance the neither of the antigen a nor antigen b synthesis takes place on the surface of rbc and the person who having this edge substance on the surface of rbc the blood group is o all right because they don't have any antigen a or antigen b on the surface of rbc now the person who having the gene a which encodes n acetyl galactosaminyl transferase enzyme but as i told you in my previous slide that for the synthesis of antigen a there must be presence of edge gene which encodes fucosyl transferase enzyme and here it transfers l fucose to this precursor chain so here first of all there is a synthesis of edge substance takes place and the person who having the gene a which encodes n acetyl galactosaminyl transferase enzyme which transfers n acetyl galactosamine to this edge substance so this n acetyl galactosamine plus l fucose plus precursor chain all these three collectively known as antigen a now the person who having the gene b which is responsible for this galactosyl transferase enzyme but as i told you earlier that for the synthesis of b antigen there must be the presence of edge gene which encodes fucosyl transferase enzyme which transfers l fucose to this precursor chain so this l fucose plus precursor chain collectively known as edge substance which is must for the synthesis of antigen b on the surface of rbc now the person who having the gene b which is responsible for the enzyme galactosyl transferase which transfers d galactose to this edge substance so this d galactose plus l fucose plus this precursor chain collectively known as antigen b now the person who having the both ab gene where's the a is responsible for the n acetyl galactosaminyl transferase enzyme and b is responsible for the galactosyl transferase enzyme but here also there must be the presence of edge gene which is responsible for the fucosyl transferase enzyme which transfers l fucose to this precursor chain so here the l fucose plus precursor chain collectively known as edge substance edge substance synthesis is must either for antigen a or antigen b synthesis on the surface of rbc now the person who having the ab gene where's the A gene is responsible for N acetyl galactosaminyl transferase enzyme which transfers N acetyl galactosamine to this edge substances and this forms antigen A on the surface of RBC now the person who having the B gene which is responsible for the galactosyl transferase enzyme which transfers D galactose to this edge substances so here it is the formation of antigen b on the surface of rbc so the person who having the ab blood group there is a presence of a antigen as well as b antigen on the surface of rbc as i told you earlier that a gene is required or must for the synthesis of either a antigen or b antigen on the surface of rbc 
and this H gene encodes fucosyl transferase enzyme which transfers L fucose to this precursor chain. So here there is a formation of H substances on the surface of RBC. Either the person who having the completely efficient H gene having both this capital H or one capital H and one small H. Here the one capital H is necessary for this activity of this fucosyl transferase enzyme. The person who having the blood group O on the surface of RBC there is a H substance and in their plasma there is an antibody A and antibody B is present but no any type of antigen A or antigen B. Now what will happen to Bombay blood group system? There is the homozygous recessive condition in which both the small h are present. So there is no any capital H allies which is present in that person. So there is no any type of synthesis of fucosyl transferase enzyme which transfers L-fucose to the precursor chain and uh, required for the synthesis of H substance. But here there is no any type of fucosyl transferase enzyme is present. So there isn't any synthesis of H substance on the surface of RBC. And I told you again and again that without H substance neither antigen A nor antigen B synthesis takes place on the surface of RBC. Even if the person having the genes for this A antigen, B antigen or AB antigen, there isn't any synthesis of either A antigen or B antigen takes place on the surface of RBC. Simply means that in the absence of this fucosyl transferase enzyme, there is not presence of antigen A or antigen B on the surface of RBC. Even if the gene A or gene B is present and their blood group must be the O and antibodies which are present in their plasma is antibody A, antibody B and antibody against H substance because there is absence of H substance on the surface of RBC. So in the person who having the Bombay blood group system, their blood group is typically O but there is a presence of three type of antibodies antibody A, antibody B and antibody against H substance. Clear to everyone? Okay. It is the rarest type of blood group. Only 4 per million of the world population have this blood group. 